it's time for nerding out again. This time I bring you a video of the installation of Cisco Modeling Labs CML installed on Proxmox. I hope you like it. This cool beat, it's called Electric Dreams, and it was made using AI for our pleasure. During this part, I'm attaching a disk drive or a CD drive to attach all the images to CML. Notice how it's orange instead of white like the rest of them. That's because the drive, it's not plug and play. That's something that I learned. You have to actually restart the machine so that it can take effect. And you will see this shortly. Not 100% sure of this part, but I was trying to, I was attempting to add a secondary Ethernet card uh, so I can just have two different interfaces, maybe one for the internet and then another one to connect to my local devices. Here, notice how it says that it can't read the disk drive with the images and it's something that's required you can definitely install it later on once everything is ready but I didn't want to do that uh, and that's when I realized that the drive uh, needed to be restarted
notice how the letters are no longer orange they're now white and the installation of CML is proceeding as intended since it can now read all the images. When it comes to the creation of the users, there is a sysadmin user for the back end of the program. And then there is a UI, in this case admin, for the front end. Do not mix the two because they're in two separate uh, URLs. When you put the IP address that you have configured, just the IP address, it will take you to the front end UI where you would use your admin user. Then if you add column 9090, that takes you to the back end for your sysadmin user. Do not mix the two. When you enter the IP address you configured, it will take you to the front end just like this. Log in with your administrator for the UI. Did you know CML had a 91 day free trial period? I didn't. And that's it. I hope you liked my video.